guys, how's it going? So the news broke this morning that Stephen Warnock has signed for Burton Albion on a one-year deal uh, after his release from Wigan Athletic uh, just recently. So what do we know about the player? So we know that he's 35 years old, a lot of experience. He's 36 in December, I think, when I've read up about him. Uh, so what else do we know about him? So in his career, he started off at Liverpool as an academy youngster, broke through the academy into the first team. Had a few games there, just scoring that one goal in his time, uh, playing for him. And eventually Liverpool sent him out on loan to the likes of Bradford City and Coventry City uh, before leaving the club on a permanent basis to join Blackburn Rovers and then eventually moving on to Aston Villa. And then after that, uh, after a few years, he went to Bolton on loan for a bit before making a permanent move to Leeds United. Stayed there for a while as well, and then eventually moved up to uh, Derby County, our well, local rivals, you say. And then eventually moved, moved to Wigan on loan after that, after a few seasons at Derby. Went to Wigan on loan before they made that permanent a year later. Spent one year there on a permanent deal before eventually signing for us. So for me, that is an ideal signing, I think, with Ben Turner being out for the first five games of the season. Uh, could this potentially mean that the club's looking to stick to a back three? Unless he just goes with Warnock and McFadden in the centre of defence with Messino just sticking in that holding role in the midfield there. Unless he does go to back three. Well, we'll never know. We'll see, we'll see uh, when the first game comes along against Cardiff. Uh, but for me, for me it's a good sign. He brings a lot of experience to the team. He's had a lot of time in the Premier League, uh, a little bit of time, in, a lot of time in the Championship as well. Um, and he can be like a, another leader in the team so could this potentially mean as well that it's a replacement for Brayford because we know Brayford's out until about January because he's having like a knee operation or something and he won't be back till that time um, so and he, well we could end up moving to another club hopefully not but we'll have to wait and see but well definitely for me is an alright sign for us so Hopefully it will work out in the end with his experience that he brings to the team. A bit of leadership in there as well. So that's all we need to know about Warnock. That's my opinion on him. And hopefully it works out for us. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Hopefully my next video will be you know, on another new signing. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. See you later.